cook a person? The devil asked me, follow. I said, my mother's flesh, walls of burgundy deny the pierce of your quartzing vertex. The point at which my following seeks light skyward and devilishly I stand still in her story. She has seen the fires of this earth we call hell. Leaden drop making snake through cheekbone and funguses forming any which way but inward. Her rising hid the pain of synthetic warmths, polycottons and red chilies kept wound around the children's guts they call this. Needs must. I do not follow. I say, my grandmother has found among her people tiring blunted light sharp. Sharp edges aligning into home place, finding rest in house shoes and potato filled folds. And footrests before eluding the watchful hand of Fatima make of home place house. Beside house becomes village, and town becomes of nursery where matriarch invests in old age, while a shrieking child punctures the borderlands and a grand cry calls forward a future. Uprising makes the sun rise later. And warmth is the spring of the sky. Schools and public housing, they call this. They call this. They call this. Revolutionary potential. He asks, What happened here? I say, My father stood before my mother's ever-fading image and in distance he found a call closer to home than to her. My mother's fingertips bitten and the venom flooding forth kept us raft bound as we fought across river to live among more than just valley and green marble mirror frame. How curious, how curious the cabinet, holding wedding photo and antidote. Leaving is escape, but arrival demands a patience with which we can do nothing but grapple. Venomous fingers are not remunerated for existing, and schooling counts only for those whose tongue makes library of knowledge and texts of Orphic home. They call this social mobility. The devil asked me to play. I say, my grandfather's life found us in figure eights around simmering waters, broths of bone shoulders, and religion less a belief but saviour's strategy, a propaganda. Lost. Lost to how we found ourselves here. There are more greens, but the greys make of them boredom. The grasses sit as puddles in lawn chairs, soon to disappear to boot blade and cloud falls and rains. My mirror and I come from splits typical of this technology, lost in how we make our self of our soul the kin of material. They call this. They call this. They call this family planning. Rejection is not read as sin. I say, my sisters made me sick until I knew illness as illness itself. A place where shreddings of orange earth swim between sugars and oils, the fundaments of being. A cousin is not a cousin is not a cousin, but an exsanguinated demon friend whom I love so dearly. And I swim between bloods and waters, not basis, but being itself. I see a smoke sky and disappear as Dionysian badger cold for enjoying too much of life. It's difficult to find a wind that does not push my devil's standing. They call this, they call this, 
blood is thicker than water My rejection is red as rejection I say We walk on solid water in the warmth of wrapped butts Brothers and sisters, brother and sister beneath uprising my cousins my cousins have seen blood shed as I am uncle to a child I do not yet know and to friend's niece as I might become uncle to my own and in such spaces we find the thickness of blood and the solidity of water become measures useless useless to the village the city the scraped grounds the heavy pillars of reflection the marshlands of Leversack and metal frame Wetlands, the botany, the corner shop, the high street, the high rise, the view through smoke, slime, the cloud ridden spired sky. A journey. A journey. Such that light is dimmed, but edges ever toward the dim of development. Making a village, an earth we call hell. A setting for her story and mine beneath. We leave For downstairs There is a shrieking child Puncturing borderlands And the grand cry Who's against a calling Who's forward a future Where there is no such Too much of life They call this They call this takes a village to raise the child it takes a village to raise the child